All right, guys, Ian Flanagan here, EXP Realty, Dallas, Texas, and I want to welcome you to this video where I'm going to show you all the critical things that you need to do to set up your business at EXP Realty, starting with the most important, which is EXP Enterprise. That's your hub for pretty much everything, EXP Realty. And I'm going to show you each system that you need to log into so you know how to navigate, connect with your state brokers, write business, and close more deals. So let's dive right into it. Now, the first one that we're going to dive into is EXP Enterprise. Once again, this is your hub for pretty much everything EXP. Realty. So once you have that passport set up, you're going to be able to log into everything that eXp offers you. So eXp Enterprise is the first system that I want you to log into. So let's go into it. Now you can see I already have mine set up. I've had it set up for over seven years at eXp Realty. I haven't even changed the password. So pretty exciting stuff. So once you get into eXp Enterprise, this is going to be considered your dashboard. This is where all the logins to pretty much everything else is located. So I'm going to refer back to Enterprise quite a bit. Um, but the neat thing about this is it archives all of your production. It archives your stock. It shows you everything that you're doing with eXp Realty. And uh, this is where you're going to come back to kind of over and over. I'm not going to dive into every single one of these, but I just want to navigate you through this so you understand where to go to find the things you're looking for. Now, one of the first things that you want to do when you sign into eXp Enterprise is set up your profile. The same with all the other systems. If it's asking you to build a profile or set up the profile, make sure you set your profiles up quickly because eXp agents refer a lot of business to one another. And if you don't have a filled out profile, they may just skip right over you. So come into the eXp homepage here, click on my business. Now drop down to my agent profile. And this is where you're going to fill out your information. Click on the next one here, my expert profile. That's where you can actually drop the copy. If you need help with writing a profile or writing a bio, leverage chat GPT, it's free. You can log in and create an amazing bio very quickly there. So make sure you fill that out. It's really, really important that you have a filled out bio in all the eXp systems. Right here on the initial homepage, we have eXp Realty. This is the consumer facing website. EXP World Holdings, this is where everything about the stock, everything that's happening with EXP World Holdings is here. Now this official press release, this one's really neat because this is where you can see the official company communication that is being released on all the different financial websites, the NASDAQ, Yahoo Finance, so on and so forth. So this is a really neat one. You can subscribe to this and actually get this sent to your email inbox. So this is something that I jump on quite a bit um, because I'm sharing the story of EXP Realty and also celebrating all the wins and all all the things that are happening with the company. So, so eXp World Holdings is where you can find that information about the stock, the board of directors, and everything that has to do with eXp World Holdings and all the companies that eXp World Holdings owns. Now back on the homepage here, you're also going to see Extend a Hand. If you want to get involved in charities, this is a great one to get involved with. They're building hundreds of homes in South America for families down there. Super amazing program. eXp Preferred Partners. Now this is an interesting one. There's a ton of different benefits of being at eXp Realty. Now the eXp affiliated business programs can help you make additional money in your transactions like selling a home warranty or connecting folks to your utility connect service. So this is where you're going to find all that information here. Once again, I'm not going to go through every single one of them, but now Curbio is a pretty incredible one to help you close more listings. This is a service that will come in and renovate houses before they even pay for it, put them on the market, sell it, and they get paid at closing. So there's some very powerful affiliated partnerships that we have with this company. Now coming back to the homepage, we're going to scroll down a little bit and we're going to show you the next section here. Now Skyslope is a platform that you want to log into pretty quickly because that's where you're going to be processing transactions and getting paid. So let's log into Skyslope real quick and I'll help you navigate. Now, once you log into Skyslope, the first thing that you're going to do is going to come down here to Working Docs, which is in the bottom right hand corner here. You're going to click on that and then you're going to go up here to Office Docs. A few of the documents that you're going to need right out of the gate is a wire fraud disclosure and also an affiliated business disclosure that I talked about with the eXp partners. This is where you find that documentation. I'm not going to go through everything on this tab, but I just want to show you where you can find these additional docs. But I also want to give you a few tips when you're processing transactions through Skyslope. Now here's the transaction that I recently closed and I want to show you the checklist here because this is the most important part about processing your documents. Every state's going to be a little bit different. You're going to have a transaction checklist, but once you have a contract in escrow or you have a listing that goes live on the MLS, you can open up a Skyslope transaction here and start processing the documentation. So this is where you're going to see all the required documents for your file. Now, once you close the transaction, you are going to be asked to upload a few documents. One's going to be the settlement statement and then also a copy of your check and a copy of eXp's check. And that will finalize and close out the transaction for you. And it's archived in here in Skyslope. 
There is additional training on SkySlope and I'll show you how to navigate and find that training once we get to the training calendar. Now back over to the homepage here, I wanna point out KV Core, this one right here. You have to initiate the setup of KV Core before it's available. So what you're gonna do is on the left-hand side here, you're gonna click on optional services. And now that you're in optional services, right here you're gonna click sign up with KV Core. You're gonna put all your information in. But what's really important is your MLS. Now once you initiate this, it's gonna take five to 10 business days for you to have this lead generation powerhouse up and running. You can upload your contacts to it. You can upload past leads. It's pretty much endless what you can do with KV Core. So it's really critical that you get this set up very quickly. Now here we are back on the homepage at eXp Enterprise and making it rain is an in-house pay-per-click service. You can put up your credit card and you can generate leads directly into your KV Core account. They set them up on Google. So this is a great way for you to get noticed on Google. I would highly recommend you optimize your Google My Business because this can really increase your Google traffic to your KV Core website. And what you really want is people reaching out to you to buy and sell. And that's what making it rain does. It helps you generate additional leads right into your KV Core dashboard. Now the next one here is eXp World. This is the cloud office. This is where the entire company is collaborating on a daily basis. There's live interactive training. Your broker support is in here. Your onboarding accounting. Pretty much the entire company is inside our eXp World. If you haven't downloaded it, I would highly recommend that you do this very quickly so you can get connected. Now just go ahead and click on the download tab here. It's gonna take you to this next site. And if you have a PC or you have a Mac, make sure you click on the right one and download it to your computer and run the software. And once you run the software, it's gonna prompt you to set up your avatar. So let me launch mine on my computer so you can see exactly what it looks like. Now, once you launch the software, it's gonna ask you to log in through your eXp alias, which is your passport. That's your first name dot last name at eXp Realty and the password that you set up. So this is what it looks like when you first log into eXp World. And I would highly recommend that you kind of walk away from the crowd and you can use your keypad you can also use your mouse and you can navigate around here so those are all avatars those are all real agents real people somewhere in the world now the quickest way to navigate through the world is through this drop down menu up on the top left so I want to show you how to get to your state broker it's very important that you connect with your state broker team as quickly as possible so right here you go down to US state broker rooms and you can see here all the different states open up here I'm gonna to navigate to Texas because that's where I'm at so as soon as you click on it, it'll teleport you directly into the state broker room. And here we are. There's a lot of different tabs that you can click here, but, but first, at least in Texas, your state may be a little bit different. You're gonna need to click this right here and sign in and they're gonna ask you some questions because most of the time you're coming into the broker room about a transaction or something like that. But this is real staff members here. You can see folks sitting here at different tables. There's several different brokers in Texas. We have a huge team here. We're processing about 7,000 escrows a month. So there's a massive amount of volume being processed with the agents here in Texas. So make sure you connect with your state broker and then also see the calendar. So also make sure that you connect with your state broker calendar. This is where the meetings are gonna be. There's gonna be trainings in there, specifically contract trainings, updates. They wanna keep you in compliance. So make sure you go into the world, connect with your state broker team and find out the calendar so you can add these meetings directly into your calendar so you won't miss anything. Now, once again, let's navigate back to eXp Enterprise and show you a little bit more before we get out of here. Now, if you have an agent that's curious to learn about eXp Realty or wants to come experience the cloud-based training, now clicking on this tab right here, eXp World Guest Pass will give you the ability to send an invite to another agent so they can set up an avatar and come into the cloud training. Now, the ShareWorks tab here, once you start closing transactions, you need to set this up. It's gonna ask you to register and set this up because this is where your stock is held. Now, once you click on ShareWorks, it's gonna open up. It's gonna also ask you to connect your E-Trade account. So just go through the prompts and set this up once you start closing transactions this is where your stock is going to be held you can sell it directly off of this platform or you can transfer it into your e-trade account sell it and buy different stocks or anything like that but it's really important that you know how to navigate where your stock is because that's your money and this can grow tremendously over the years now the next thing that I want to show you here is the training calendar so if you scroll down here to the education calendar and click on this tab this is going to take you to expcloud.com now this is in real time and the great thing about this is there's over 80 hours of live interactive training 
every single day in the cloud campus. It's pretty phenomenal. Now, if you're looking to attend one of these trainings inside eXp World, this is how you find it. You actually click on it and it'll tell you where eXp University, and then it's inside the eXp University Conference Hall 1. So let me show you how to find that in the world. So here we are back inside eXp World, and we're gonna navigate over to that eXp University Conference Hall. So up here in the top hand left corner, you're gonna click go to. We're gonna scroll down here to eXp University. Click on that one and then eXp University Conference Hall 1. And then automatically it's going to teleport you into that conference hall for that specific training. And that's how you find the trainings that are on the eXp calendar to find them inside the world. Now back on eXp Enterprise here, these other tabs here, the Explore Guide and the Knowledge Base is basically an archive of information. If you're searching for certain topics outside of business hours, you can come in here and there's FAQs and a lot of different resources for you to find what you're looking for. If you're looking to become a certified mentor in your local market, you can click here. It'll show you the mentorship programs as well. Now down here in the bottom is gonna be your marketing center, logos, brand, merchandise, stuff like that. So if you're looking to put a listing on the market, you can click on the marketing center and get flyers for the property, postcards for the property. There's newsletters in here that you can mail to your sphere of influence. There's a lot of marketing materials in here that are already templated. You just log into the marketing center, add the property addresses, then you can save to PDF, send to a print shop or print them off at home. And if you're looking for signs and business cards, you click on the logo branding and signs. If you're looking for eXp merchandise like shirts and hats, you click on the brand store and you get a discount through that store as well. Now the next one that I wanna show you is eXp Workplace. It's super important that you get connected and get inside eXp Workplace as quickly as possible. So let's dive into it. So here we are inside Workplace. This is a collaborative platform that goes 24 seven. It's a white label Facebook platform. What does that mean? It's basically Facebook for the entire eXp community. And once again, you have to be authenticated to get into the site and this is where kind of I like to say the magic happens because there's so many people that are willing to collaborate and share, but you also have to think of this as like a, a search. So first thing that I would navigate to is your state group. So I'm in Texas. So I'm gonna navigate directly to my Texas state group and this is where you can get connected to your brokers. The neat thing about this platform also is you can direct message anybody in the company from the top down. Glenn Sanford, the founder of eXp Realty, He's in Workplace. He puts videos in here, they do training. I've seen him in here talking with Grant Cardone, so it's a really neat platform and you can message pretty much anybody in the company directly through Workplace. But most importantly, it's for where you get connected to the agents and brokers in your local market. So regardless of where you are in the country or in the world, eXp Workplace is how you connect with your brokers, the transaction team, and everybody else involved in your local market and also in your state. And you can also find additional documents and files. Skyslope is one place that they keep additional documents, but also in your state group in the file section, that's where you're also gonna be able to find archived documents, transaction checklists, anything specific to your state and doing business are gonna drop in that files tab. So it's super important to get connected into Workplace as quickly as possible. Now, other uses of eXp Workplace is, let's say you wanna update your listing presentation. Well, you can go over here and type in listing presentation and see what comes up. It's like a Google search. So there's gonna be a ton of agents that have uploaded their listing presentations here. So you can see what other people are doing. So coming to Workplace and typing in different keyword searches could be, you could be looking for REO, you could be looking for the affinity program. You could be looking for agents in your local market. I use this platform quite a bit to connect with agents that are in my local market when I need to have either people open up doors or get information about additional whatever in that area, vendors, so on and so forth. But once again, workplace is where you can come and you can find your people in your state, but most importantly, your state brokers. This is how you communicate with them. I would highly recommend you reach out to your broker if they haven't reached out to you, connect with them, make sure you know how to navigate through the eXp world and the workplace here. These are the two platforms that you're gonna use to connect with your state brokers. Now, another thing you're gonna wanna do very quickly is downloading the apps on your phone so you can connect with your state brokers and also other eXp agents. And the first one I would say is eXp Workplace. Make sure you download that. You can find it in the app store and also Workplace Chat. 
just like Facebook, where you have the Facebook app and then you have the chat or the DM app. So make sure you download those two. You're also going to want to download EXP Intercom. That is the cloud office basically on your phone. So you can attend trainings from basically anywhere you have a Wi-Fi connection. You can be in between listing appointments or, or you could be somewhere else where you want to listen into a training. You don't have the full avatar capability on your phone, but you can listen into any training no matter where you are located. So getting the apps downloaded to your phone is a fast way for you to connect with the training and also messaging your state brokers if you have a question or need their help on the weekends. Now another thing that you're going to need to set up very quickly or transfer is your MLS access. Make sure that you get everything updated with your current MLS and make sure you have your e-key. If you're new to the business, the e-key is how you open up doors and a lot of agents drop the ball with that. So get that set up as quickly as possible because your state documents to write contracts are gonna be provided to you through your MLS board. Now SkySlope and Workplace State Group is where you're gonna find those additional documents that you may need to process transactions. So I hope you got a lot of value out of this video. You can always message me directly if you have my contact information. You can shoot me a message through Workplace as well. If you have any questions, be sure to reach out and I wish you the best of luck at eXp Realty because it's completely changed my life and my family's life over the last several years. I have the golden handcuffs on and I wish nothing for the best for you and your family and success at eXp Realty. So I'll see you soon.